Mrs. Chia will present about recurrent pregnancy loss, the midwife support. It is interesting topic, but before Ms. Sifia start the presentation, I will introduce her. Ms. Sifia Ragava is a seasoned nurse educator with two decades of experience in fostering positive and inclusive learning environments. Currently a lecturer at the College of Nursing at Sultan Qaboos University in Muscat, Oman. She focuses on clinical teaching, evaluation, nursing research, and evidence-based education. Divya's career includes roles such as learning and development manager at Via Beta Care Wellness Private Limited and lecturer at MS Ramie Institute of Nursing Education and Research. She excels in simulation-based education and has published in peer review journal while incorporating active learning in her teaching practice. As a midwife, the DPR participation in research congress has been particularly rewarded. She has presented uh, papers across various venues sharing insights from midwifery and contributing to the broader nursing community. Her work empowers nurses and educators through intellectual stimulation and the extent of knowledge and best practice. So, Ms. Divya, the time is yours. Oh, thank you, Ms. Ruska, for that. Uh, okay. Let me start uh, my presentation now. Uh, I hope I am audible. Audible enough? Yes. Okay. So... Here I am. Thank you, Mr. Ruska, once again for the opportunity and for the introduction. And uh, let me start the presentation by briefly introducing just a quick, uh, quick about myself. Why am I here? Now, I see a big ocean of midwives who are actively involving and uh, working towards the common good of bringing good to people around. Uh, me being a nurse educator um, and with my background of midwifery, feel that I am a bit out of the scene when I'm in when it, it is concerned about direct patient practice. However, while teaching the students about care of women in antenatal, intranatal, and postnatal period, I understand a lot of challenges which midwives go through and their lifestyle. I always believe that midwives with their holistic approach to healthcare serve as pillars of support, not only for women, but for families, because uh, having a child is everyone's dream. Beyond clinical expertise, midwives also offer a compassionate presence. They also serve as advocates and educators, and most of the times are confident throughout pregnancy for any women. Uh, the reason why this topic is chosen, recurrent pregnancy loss, is because of its background, where it's coming from. The place where uh, this is a part, this particular paper or presentation is part of a research which aimed at identifying the psychosocial distress among women who undergo recurrent pregnancy loss. And the topic was choice uh, chosen because of the increased incidence of uh, number of women who come to hospital or the particular hospital where we take our students who have history of uh, more than one pregnancy loss. It could be uh, research says it could be uh, it could be due to their genetic makeup with a short cervix or it could be related to multiple pregnancy or grand multiparas or elderly pr um, uh, pregnancies which contributed to the number of increased pregnancy loss for women. And one of the reasons this was taken up as a research in the institution. Ms. Riska, I'm still not done with the first slide. May, may I go back to the first slide? Uh, I'm sorry for this, but Ms. Riska, I'm still uh, not finished with the first slide, which talks about what is recurrent pregnancy loss. Now, recurrent, uh, to uh, start with, recurrent pregnancy loss is also referred to as Recurrent miscarriage, which is a distressing reproductive health condition characterized by loss of three or more consecutive pregnancies before the fetus reaches viability. Across the world, approximately 1 to 2 percent of couples attempting to conceive posing significant emotional, physical and psychological changes for individuals, they go through uh, a psychological distress. The next slide, please, Ms. Riska. 
Uh, women experiencing recurrent pregnancy loss often face significant emotional distress, including feelings of grief, guilt, anxiety, and depression. And this was very well identified in the research which was conducted by the team in uh, this particular setting. These emotional challenges can impact their overall well-being and may require supportive care from healthcare professionals, including obstetricians, midwives, counselors, and support group. And that's where midwives play a main role because they are the first channel of communication and they are the they are the advocates between patients and physicians yes we can move ahead we could go ahead with the num slides now managing recurrent pregnancy loss uh, through research through various literatures it proves management of recurrent pregnancy loss typically involves a comprehensive evaluation to identify any underlying causes and develop personalized treatment plans. It includes genetic testing, hormonal therapies, surgical interventions to correct uterine anomalies, lifestyle modifications, also supportive care, including emotional support, counseling, and education about reproductive health is essential throughout this process. The next, uh, okay. now let me try to connect uh, quickly how I felt this, this topic could be of uh, interest to VIDM, which talks about uh, how sustainable midwifery can bring change to the world. Okay, so I feel sustainable midwifery involves not only addressing immediate healthcare needs of women who undergo recurrent pregnancy loss, but will also promote long-term well-being and resilience for individuals. In the context of recurrent pregnancy loss, midwives play a vital role in fostering the sustainable healthcare practices, which involves early diagnosis, management, contraception measures, support care, emotional support, and so on. So that's how I could relate this particular topic to the theme of VIDM for this year. Yes. Now, what I go, go on the next few slides, which I'm going to present, is about uh, various themes which were identified through our research, which meant, which uh, categorize the role of midwives in various aspects in order to ensure a woman or a couple with a history of recurrent pregnancy loss is supported well. To begin with, it talks about the emotional support. Midwives play a crucial role in providing emotional support to women who experience. This is uh, known not only for women experiencing a recurrent pregnancy loss, but for every woman who comes to the labor room, midwives are the source of support. Their role aligns with sustainable healthcare practices by recognizing and addressing the psychological impact of recurrent pregnancy loss thereby contributing to the overall mental health. So they not only take care of the physical health, but contribute to the overall mental health of the women. Midwives establish open communication channels with women experiencing recurrent pregnancy loss and create a safe and supportive environment. Through empathetic counseling, midwives will help women navigate through the emotional challenges of recurrent pregnancy loss, fostering coping strategies and enhancing mental well-being. There are a lot of research evidences which mention the importance of emotional support being given by midwives for women who go through various fertility-related stress and fertility-related stress disorders. A study, pub few of them quoted here are a study published in the Journal of Obstetrics and Gynecological and Neonatological Nursing demonstrated a significant decrease in anxiety and depression level with midwives' emotional support. It was reported in 2019. Another study of 2018 by uh, Kakrate et al. said the Brit in the British General of Midwifery emphasized the importance of midwives' empathetic counseling in facilitating coping strategies and improving overall mental well-being in women. Midwives' provision of emotional support in the context of RPL contributes to sustainable model of care that prioritizes holistic well-being. So the women um, holistic women, the care of the women is what is being prioritized and that's how we connect it to our sustainable midwifery. By addressing the psychological impact of recurrent pregnancy loss, midwives promote resilience and empower women 
to navigate their reproductive journey with support and confidence. Uh, the next role which was identified through the research and uh, supporting literature was the role nurse plays, the nurse midwife plays for education and information dissemination. Now, uh, it's not important just to take care of the mental and physical well-being. It's also important to ensure that such such cases are not repeated or they do not they have a better coping strategy and they know what is happening to them. So health education or being an educator is an imperative part of being a midwife. And that's how the role of midwife gets a strong support because she is an educator. Education and information dissemination are essential components uh, for this practice, sustainable midwifery practice. Midwives play a crucial role in empowering women with knowledge to make informed decisions about their reproductive health. <clears throat> Midwives would explain medical procedures and provide insight into lifestyle factors which were relevant to the reproductive health of a woman, not only during pregnancy, but in case of uh, adverse, uh, in case of uh, the difficult scenarios where she has to lose a baby and she has to go through the grieving process, they help them with providing adequate education. Through their guidance, midwives enable women to actively engage in their care and make choices aligned with their health goals. A study published in Journal of Midwifery and Women's Health demonstrated that midwives' provision of comprehensive information increased women's knowledge and confidence in managing their reproductive health. So it's a common umbrella where they act as educators to help the women to improve their health. Findings from systematic review in BMC pregnancy and childbirth indicated that women who received education from midwives had lower rates of recurrent pregnancy loss, attributed and which was attributed to the lifestyle changes which they brought in, such as smoke and obesity, after the educational um, uh, intervention was given. By educating women about medical procedures and lifestyle factors, midwives promote their health literacy and empower women to take control of their reproductive health. So they give, it's it's meeting the uh, WHO standard of putting one's health in their own hands. So the midwives just empower them with education and give them the power to decide about themselves. This educational aspect supports sustainable practices by fostering informed decision-making and proactive health management among women. Midwives' educational efforts have tangible benefits in reducing rates of recurrent pregnancy loss, particularly by addressing modifiable risk factors such as smoking and obesity. Empowering women with knowledge about lifestyle factors can contribute to pre better pregnancy outcomes and overall reproductive health. The, the next uh, slide would talk of the further role of a, a midwife in supporting the in in supporting um, uh, the women who underwent recurrent pregnancy loss, and it is about care coordination. Care coordination is all about how they can be coordinators with between them and the other healthcare practice healthcare practitioners. Care coordination is a key aspect of midwifery support for women experiencing re recurrent pregnancy loss. Midwives ensure an efficient and collaborative healthcare delivery by coordinating care among various healthcare professionals so they talk to them uh, they talk to the physicians they talk to obstetricians they uh, guide them uh, guide the patients to interact with uh, a psychologist if required or social reformist whoever is going to help the patient to recover or come out of this uh, uh, stressful situation nurse uh, the midwife acts as a coordinator it aligns with sustainability principle again by optimizing resources and minimizing redundancies. So if they are managed well in a particular uh, particular um, uh, event, when a particular event happens and they are managed well by giving them proper education, giving them good support, encouraging them to uh, adopt healthy lifestyle practices, the redundancy of coming back with a similar episode is less. Through collaboration with healthcare professionals, midwives contribute to a comprehensive and coordinated approach to take care of the women with RPL or recurrent pregnancy loss. A study published in the International Journal of Nursing Practice highlighted the effectiveness of midwives in coordinating care for women with recurrent pregnancy loss, leading to improved patient outcomes and satisfaction. 
findings for another uh, randomized controlled trial in 2021, which was published in the Journal of Advanced Nursing, demonstrated that collaborative care led by midwives resulted in reduced healthcare costs and improved re resource utilization in the management of recurrent pregnancy loss. Collaborative care facilitated by midwives enhances the efficiency and effectiveness of healthcare delivery for women with recurrent pregnancy loss. By working closely with other healthcare professionals, midwives ensure that women receive comprehensive and timely care tailored to their individual needs. Effective care coordination by midwives lead to improved patient outcomes, satisfaction, and overall experience of women undergoing the treatment. The collaborative approach not only benefits individual patients, but also contributes to the sustainability of healthcare system by optimizing resource utilization. So in the setup where we have done this uh, study, a particular research, we identified that the midwives are coordinating with the obstetricians, with the nurse, nurses, the obstetrical nurses, with the social support workers who provide support, with counselors, with psychologists, and other healthcare and with the health centers where the primary health centers where the, the women uh, register themselves initially in the initial part of pregnancy and uh, which would help in better identification of high risk cases and managing them early. So this helps to prevent the recurrence of uh, pregnancy loss or identifying high risk mother in advance. May I have this next slide, Ms. Ruska? Okay, so the uh, we are talking about the collaborative care, uh, which is the last theme which was identified or last uh, part of the um, uh, care, the concept of how midwives can support uh, these women uh, is collaborative care. It is something similar like like uh, coordinating with others, where in co in coordination she plays more of a role of a liaison uh, and uh, uh, someone who interacts with uh, multiple team members and in collaborative care she plans her care and implements them so they play midwives play a crucial role in promoting sustainable midwifery practices through the preconception support group and advocacy this is what i mentioned where it was identified that the midwives who are who are attached to the primary health centers where women go and register themselves in early pregnancy, they act, uh, they uh, combine with the uh, physicians uh, and try to give proper health education and supportive care to, for females who are identified as high risk. These practices emphasize preventive care, community support, and empowerment, ultimately contributing to the long-term well-being of women facing recurrent pregnancy loss. Research published in the Journal of Obstetrics and Gynecological uh, Gynecology Canada highlighted the positive impact of midwives' preconception care interventions. The qualitative study in the Journal of Perinatal Education also emphasized the importance of midwives' advocacy effects. Mid midwives will advocate for access to support groups and community resources for women with recurrent pregnancy loss fostering empowerment and resilience. Through preconception care, midwives focus on preventive measures to optimize women's reproductive health before conception. Support groups provide a platform for women to share experiences, receive emotional support, and access community resources, fostering empowerment and resilience. By focusing on the long-term well-being of women facing recurrent pregnancy loss, the midwives contribute to development of resilient communities. Empowering individuals with knowledge and resources enables them to make informed choices about their reproductive health, ultimately contributing to the overall health of the um, uh, the overall health of the uh, and resilience of the community. So. Uh, from our presentation, um, uh, Ms. Ruska, I am uh, to the conclusion slide where, um, uh, make it, may, may, maybe go to the conclusion slide, Ms. Ruska. So through the presentation, uh, as I mentioned, uh, uh, being from uh, the nurse educator side, uh, my, my interest more on this aspect was how a midwife or a nurse can be prepared in her role to handle patient who come with stressful pregnancy. Pregnancy, though, is a joyful event for many, but for some, it becomes a dreadful situation when they do not 
uh, have what is desired. So a midwife uh, plays a crucial role in managing patients with recurrent pregnancy loss by providing holistic care and support throughout the process. She plays a vital role in multidisciplinary approach to managing patients with recurrent pregnancy loss, offering compassionate care, guidance, and advocacy to support their physical and emotional well-being throughout their reproductive journey. In the face of adversities, midwives also stands as a ray of hope, guiding women towards healing and towards getting renewed strength. Through compassionate care, they prepare the mother to begin their journey for a brighter tomorrow. As we embark today on this journey, which happens every year, where we are identifying or uh, we are celebrating being a midwife, mm, uh, uh, we, must learn the, uh, we must learn to dedicate ourselves or honor ourselves for the ex uh, exemplary work we do with women. Uh, we work with commitment and uh, we empower women to towards the healing path with resilience. Uh, together, we affirm that uh, a coll collective commitment towards providing holistic care for women, not only with recurrent pregnancy loss, but with any stressful situation, will ensure that they are never left alone through their journey of uh, planned, unplanned or stressful parenthood. With that, uh, I guess I would like to end this session. 